how to install a vinyl blind came from Walmart. Um, the size is 23 width and 42 inches long. You measure your window and go from there. Uh, no instruction on it. There's no instruction needed anyways, except for one thing, that um, how to snap the brackets. These are the screws and brackets. The only thing you need to know is how to, how to install this bracket. This is the bracket. This is the top. Goes to the window casing up there and this piece get hooked to the vinyl. I'm just going to show you and first you take this thing off and see this groove right over here you put this one like that and right here you snap it like this that's it and and this thing is gonna be hooked up to the casing on the window so that's all it is I'm gonna slide it out let me show you one more time this thing goes right here and this portion is snapped so you don't have to pry it open like this just take that piece off and slide it out so it won't get messed up let's go show you the window and another thing uh, make sure this hole is facing you. That's where this crank shaft goes. The tools that you need is uh, fill up a screwdriver, measuring tape, and if you got the cordless drill, I can't find mine, so I might use the electric one and uh, that's about it you know even if you don't have the drill just use the screwdriver so this is the window i got two blinds and i'm gonna hook it up right over here let's take this curtain out because this is a not that wide window so Two works for these bracket work perfectly. Right over here, you can install. Right here, wherever you want to put it, make sure it's even, and the top piece goes up there, and this latch is going to be toward you. One here and one here, one here, that's, that's about it. So, that's about it. So all the brackets are hooked up to see the distance. You don't have to have an extra wood for it. I had it because I had a different curtains over here. So I didn't have to make more holes up in there. So right there, it goes right here.
as the other end goes right here. You don't have to do that. I had it already. Okay, now you see this channel? Groove. It goes right, right in this. Let me show you. Okay, you see? Once these channels are in the groove, this, this thing just is snapped in. One. That's it. Pretty solid though. Same thing with the other one. You put them in the groove and a snap them. Oh, it's not in the groove yet. So folks, that's all in the groove. You see that? Pretty nice, huh? Just a snap thing. So that's how it look after you get done. All you gotta do is pull it down, pull it up. That's pretty good. And if you wanna close it, You're gonna close it. There you go. So that's how it looks. And these screws, you can use them if you wanted to, if you got a wider um, blind but you don't need it. It's pretty solid and they are light. So just disregard those things. Bye now. Thanks for watching. Oh, did I say thanks for watching? Oh, don't worry about these ones. You don't need them. Unless if it is a wider one. But one more thing. You need a drill tip that you can pilot holes, you know, so you won't split or damage the wood. Bye now.